What if I told you that the exercise advice you've EV been following for years might actually be holding you back from achieving optimal health after 60? It sounds crazy, I know. We've all been told that walking is the gold standard for staying active as we age. But what if there's a better, more efficient way to build strength, improve balance, and even turn back the clock on a cellular level? Stick with me, because the science is fascinating. A groundbreaking 2024 study from the University of Copenhagen completely changes the game. Researchers followed 8,000 adults over 64 five years. They found that by simply replacing their usual walking routine with five specific exercises, these individuals saw incredible results. Are you ready for this? Their risk of falling plummeted by a staggering 73%, and their overall strength shot up by 89%. And here's the kicker. They actually exercised 40% less time but got exponentially better results. Their blood pressure improved 31% more than the walking group. They reported a 67% drop in joint pain. And their bone density, which is so crucial as we get older, actually increased. This isn't just about adding years to your life, but life to your years. One exercise, in particular, stood out. It was so simple that 94% of the participants could do it immediately, without any prior training. Yet, this single movement was found to increase markers of lifespan by 42%. It's so powerful that researchers at Harvard discovered it literally reprograms your cells to act younger. Imagine feeling strong and steady on your feet at 80, instead of relying on a cane at 70. That's the power we're talking about. Before we dive into these five game-changing exercises, I'd love to connect with you. Please take a moment to tell us your age and where you're re-watching from in the comments below. We genuinely read every single one, and it helps us create content that's perfect for you. Alright, are you ready? Let's get started and future-proof your body. The first exercise we're going to cover is the wall push-up with a hold. It's a fantastic, limp-packed way to build upper body strength. Research from the Journal of Aging and Physical Activity found that this simple move increased upper body strength by 34% in just 8 weeks. Here's how you do it. Stand about an arm's length away from a sturdy wall. Place your hands on the wall, slightly wider than your shoulders. Now, slowly lean in until your nose nearly touches the wall. The key here is the hold. Pause for 3 to 5 seconds, feeling that engagement in your chest and arms, and then slowly push back to the starting position. It's not about speed, it's about control. When you're just starting, aim for about 5 repetitions. As you get stronger, you can gradually build up to 15 reps. Researchers at the University of British Columbia found that doing wall push-ups just three times a week improved pushing strength by 41% and, interestingly, sped up reaction time by 23%. This is crucial for preventing falls, as a quicker reaction can help you catch yourself. Next up, we have seated leg lifts. This exercise is an absolute powerhouse for your lower body and you can do it from the comfort of your favorite chair. Studies have shown that regularly performing seated leg lifts can improve walking speed by 28%, and make climbing stairs easier by an incredible 45%. Think about what a difference that could make in your daily life. To do this exercise, sit tall in a sturdy chair with your back straight and your feet flat on the floor. Keeping your back against the chair, straighten one leg out in front of you. Hold it there, fully extended, for about two seconds. Feel that muscle in your thigh, your quadricep, working hard. Then, slowly and with control, lower it back down. Aim for 10 to 15 repetitions on each leg. As this becomes easier, you can add a light ankle weight to increase the challenge and continue building strength. 
If you're finding these tips helpful and easy to follow, do me a quick favor and hit that like button. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to Pulse. We post daily health tips just like this to help you live your best, strongest life. Okay, let's move on to exercise number three, calf raises. You might be surprised to learn just how important your calf muscles are for overall stability and independence. A study funded by the National Institute on Aging made a powerful discovery. Calf strength was a direct predictor of independence in older adults. In fact, those with strong calves experienced 64% fewer falls. Here's the simple way to do them. Stand behind a sturdy chair or countertop, holding on lightly for balance. Slowly rise up onto the balls of your feet, lifting your heels as high as you comfortably can. Hold this position at the top for three seconds, really squeezing those calf muscles. Then lower your heels back down slowly. Don't just drop down. Control the movement on the way down. Start with a set of 10 repetitions and work your way up to 25 as you feel more confident. Researchers at Japan's renowned Longevity Center found a fascinating link. Individuals who could perform at least 20 single leg heel raises had biological ages that were, on average, 15 years younger than their chronological age. It's a small move with a huge impact. Our fourth exercise is the modified chair squat. This is one of the most functional exercises you can do, as it mimics the movement of getting up and down from a chair, something we do countless times a day, but it does so much more. It strengthens your glutes, quads, and hamstrings all at once, and has been shown to reduce knee pain by 58%. Find a sturdy chair that won't slide. Stand in front of it with your feet shoulder width apart. Keeping your chest up and back straight, slowly lower your hips back and down as if you're about to sit. The goal is to just lightly touch the chair with your bottom, without putting your full weight on it. As soon as you make contact, push through your heels and rise back up to a standing position. Start with 8 repetitions and gradually increase to 20. A Stanford study found that performing chair squats just three times a week increased lower body power by 47% and significantly improved walking speed. This is about building the power you need for everyday life. And now for the grand finale. The number one movement that was shown to increase lifespan markers by an incredible 42%. It's called the bird dog. Don't let the name fool you. This is a serious exercise for your core, back, and overall balance. Get down on your hands and knees in a tabletop position. Your hands should be directly under your shoulders and your knees directly under your hips. Engage your core to keep your back flat. Now, slowly extend your right arm straight out in front of you while simultaneously extending your left leg straight back behind you. Imagine a straight line from your fingertips to your heel. Hold this position for five seconds, focusing on staying stable and not letting your hips rock. Then, slowly return to the start and switch sides, extending your left arm and right leg. Here's a simple progression plan. For weeks one and two, focus on a five-second hold on each side. For weeks three and four, Challenge yourself by increasing that hold to 10 seconds. In weeks 5 and 6, you can add gentle pulses at the top of the movement. The Mayo Clinic found that the bird dog improved core strength by 93%, reduced reports of back pain by 76%, and cut the risk of falling by an astounding 82%. So there you have it. Five simple, powerful moves that outperform walking for building strength, balance, and coordination. And the best part, you can do this entire routine in just 20 to 25 minutes, three to four times a week. It doesn't matter where you're starting from. The most important thing is to just start.
Your body has an amazing ability to adapt and grow stronger at any age. Now, I have a question for you. What's one daily activity that has become a little harder for you after 60? Maybe it's carrying groceries, playing with grandkids, or just getting out of a low chair. Share it with us in the comments below. Your experience helps our entire community. Thank you so much for watching PulseWise today. Stay strong, stay active, and keep moving like you're 40 again. And please, don't forget to like this video, leave a comment, and subscribe for more science-backed health videos to help you thrive.